It's, it's been a while since I've, I've had one quite like that. What, what, where am I? Is this from the update of Kingdom Keys? Is this Traverse Town? How did I get here? I'm in Traverse Town. Um, at least I think so. Because this looks like OG Traverse Town. Hello. Is anybody here? Or did I get transported to a random location? I'm curious what's going on. Well, it certainly has a lot of good stuff. I think I'm gonna mark this place on my... on my interbook. It, it even says it's Traverse Town! Okay! I didn't even have to rename it. It was already there. Um, yeah, okay. I'm, I'm gonna try to use an Enderwing Prime and see if I can get to my other base or if my base is destroyed. Uh, because this may have spawned over it. I don't know. It'd be kind of sad, but at least I'd have all of Traverse Town to call my own. I mean, that's a thing I could do. It would certainly be an exchange for my base if it happens to have gone out. Okay. Let me attempt this. Enderwing Prime. Let's do this. Wrong dimension? This counts as another dimension? How do I get to the overworld? Um, this could be a problem. Uh, well, continuing journey of me getting... Uh, completely baffled by the fact that although I originally designed this to be nice and easy, it's not really being nice and easy in terms of uh, how I'm winding up going where I want to go. Um, yeah, I'm in Traverse Town. I, I, I just came from the end and now I'm not in the overworld. I'm in Traverse Town. I'm wondering, could I jump to the nether and then back out? Like, can I use an ender portal in this new dimension? Because that's an interesting question. Because uh, I think I might be able to solve my own problem if I do that. Uh, here's the main fountain. Uh, I, I could see ores definitely show up in the stone. Hey, you! I just got myself a Wither Skeleton Skull. Uh, okay. Hey! Shoopa. I'm, I'm not in the mood. Okay. I hope it didn't just eat that. I hope this is a desync. Because if that did, I am in big trouble. So I might not be able to get out of here. Maybe it has a... Okay, it, it popped back over here. Can I put it... No, it, it's, it's a visual desync. It's retrieving it and putting it back to me. But I need a spot that I can place it down, because if I can't place a block, I am in big trouble. See, can I actually break a block though? Nope, it's it's basically like spawn protection. So I need to figure a way to get out of this area. And this space is actually occupied by my transmutation table is just not showing up that way. Huh, 
This isn't working either. I might have... okay, that's there now. There's a serious set of desyncing issues here. Uh, yeah... I need to be able to place a block so that I can use transmutation, because if I can use transmutation, I can theoretically get out of this place. Of course, I might not really need to if I can get enough obsidian. That would be an interesting twist exit. But I need to find the, the big doors out. But yeah, this is not what I intended. I am definitely in an odd situation here. I can't tell where the way out might be. That looks like a door out. Maybe if I go up. The question is, can I exit? Like, if I keep going around, can I find a way out? Like, it's been a while since I played, like, original Kingdom Hearts. So, I'm gonna have to really think of my uh, orientation in terms of it being like Traverse Town, and think, where was any possible exit? Huh. Well, that door didn't... <laughs> that door didn't quite make it. Uh, <laughs> Okay, yeah, a lot of it seems to be following a similar layout, so that's good. However, I don't remember which way it was to the way out of Traverse Town. That's bad. <laughs> Here I am, future vampire in Traverse Town, and I can't seem to find the exit. Uh, That's spawn protected? Yes, it is. Um, hmm. Okay. I do have monk powers. Wait, now on top of monk powers, I have certain other spawning powers. Um, Fred Astaire. Uh huh. This works. Okay. I, I feel better now. Although it does seem to be... Oop, black wool. That's defended, so can't go that way out. Um, hmm. Need to find exit. That kind of looks like it might... No, it doesn't fully connect as a way out. I need to find a way that actually exits out of here. Other than dying. Because I need to be able to figure out how to technically do it the correct way. That looks kind of like it. Yeah, that, that, that looks like it would be a corridor out. Okay, so which... Okay, buddy, you're a little big to go into these buildings, so I need to... See, buildings... And this is not the route. Well, I do see tons and tons of various loots. But since I can't place blocks, I can just... It's it's not I don't think I've been placed in adventure mode. Have I been? Okay, let's see if that's it. Nope, it is spawn protection. I usually don't have to do things like that, but it certainly shows this is different. Okay, so this world is in fact defended from itself and others and everybody. Does make me wonder. Oops. 
stupid. Okay, that does go both ways, so I'm not stuck. Uh, Merlin's house. And house of the fairy godmother. They, they kind of shared, they kind of shared a place. Uh, no Merlin here, obviously. Uh, it would be nice if I had a Merlin, because Merlin might be able to help me out. But that's not happening. Potions of strength, swiftness, generation, harming, a saddle. It's good stuff. Good stuff. I'm gonna have to periodically just check and see if I can break anything, because I know I can place something. Although it's interesting that my automatic torch placing device is still working. Apparently it can't um, bypass the bypass that, uh, that those have in an enchantment table. So it can't bypass the method that it uses, so therefore it's not protected from placing them. Oh yeah, that this brings me back. Spawn wolf? Okay. That would be nice. I, I, I can't really trust my inventory right now because I if I can't place blocks, I can't transmute. If I can't transmute, then inevitably I will get very full on stuff. So there. I mean I initially just wanted just wanted to get very particular things from the end. I wanted to get Ender Shards as a material, and I wanted to get those Eyes of the Watcher, or watch, Watcher Eyes. And then that would be pretty much all I was really after. But it didn't turn out that way. Because instead of being sent back to the overworld, I was sent here. Into Traverse Town. Which brings up so many questions of how am I going to deal with this. Because I thought I could just find an exit, and that's proving to not be quite as simple as I first thought, even with flying around. Some of the pathways don't seem to fully connect. And I've definitely been this way. I mean, I can get food from the enemies here. So I'm not going to have too much of an issue with that. But it's all the other things. I don't want to blast my way through, because I don't think that'll really solve it. There's probably something I need to use to get out. And whenever I find it, I can get out. You know, I might want... Well, at least the bed's not exploding. Uh, that That's kind of good, or at least not bad. Um, because we, we know what happens when beds are used in dimensions normally. They explode and take you down with them. That is a ton of golden apples and other stuff. I mean, seriously, that's kind of an amazing amount of things. Do I have to... wait. Do I really have to explore everything to find some way out of here? Because if I have to, like, find a certain NPC, there's a chance that they haven't really developed that entirely yet. Because the mod has had some updates. And I am wondering, do I have to find a certain NPC that describes the way out? Or do I just find an exit door or a teleporter or something? And yes, teleporters are a thing in this mod. So maybe it just shifts me out and I go to the overworld that way. But, as of right now, I'm not sure how I get out of Traverse Town. This is a problem. I mean, I could off myself. I'd rather not. I'd rather find what, however you're meant to get out of here. Well, I'm finding just the loot du jour along the way. Most of it in pretty much the same places you'd find in the game, now that I'm really kind of getting the nostalgia starting to pop back. Uh, but, I'm still just not remembering the way out, because I thought that you had to do a boss battle, and apparently, the thing is, that would normally be at the fountain, but I'm not getting a boss battle at the fountain. It's just kind of there, and 
gosh, if you could really bypass... Well, I theoretically could bypass the protection. Because, again, you have an ally that can blow stuff up. And this is breaking not only Vethia, but having Vethia and other things break each other. So, there's a chance I could just bust it and grab unbelievable amounts of stuff. Gotta check once in a while, see if I'm far enough away from the center of the effect. So far the answer is no. Man, this place is, you know, this place being dark this way would make it great for being a vampire. Like, seriously. Like, just, just think about it. This place is, like, completely cordoned off from the sun. Because it has, like, this area up above, and it's completely invincible, like, you, because of the, of the, like, protective shield this place is all under. Which is, like, totally everywhere. And that would mean that if I were to take this as a base of operations for being a vampire, it would work beyond all recognition. Like, it would just be amazing. That's where I heard the sound of a chupacabra. He's just hanging out on a ledge. I do love how my, uh, my auto torch is still working fine. I mean, seriously, I thought there was something there. Man, they did a great place recreating it in Minecraft blocks, though. I mean, seriously. Um, congrats. Because this is possibly even... Oh, boy. It's going to say two scale. True. Okay, got rid of the Gru. Ugh. Okay, that happened. In a way, they're kind of acting like the Heartless, because they are creatures of darkness coming out to pop around the area. I haven't seen the actual Heartless yet, but I know that they're present in the mod. Oh wait, I did the... the, the silver... silver bells count. The silver... silver wire. Wait, if I can't place blocks, then that's also useless. Oh boy. Because I was thinking that maybe Obsidian could help me get a portal out, but if that's not happening... Okay, that would be a bit of an issue. Uh, I think the most useless thing to me that I can throw away right now would be... Hmm... What is it I'm not going to get much of? Well, I can throw out the bowl, actually has no EMC value, and I'm not going to be getting mushrooms anytime soon. But I wound up getting a Gru Claw. At least I'm getting equipment parts. Okay, I've been up here, but is there some place I can g find or see that seems suspiciously like an area that I need to go to? Yeah, th those leaps off the sides because of my Kryptonian no-fall damage powers is awesome. Haha, hidden chest. It's not so hidden. At least I've got a supply of food in case I need it, but... In terms of sustained food, my only choice is defeat mobs. I could eat Chupacabra for a while, admittedly. I mean, it's not my first choice of food, but... I mean, you get some leech, uh, s some leeching type ability from it, which is nice. But that's usually more if it's cooked. Hmm. A lot of problems with this scenario. Lots of problems. Because I need a way out, and it's not being very forthcoming. Because you'd think I'd trigger an event or see an NPC, but not happening. At least not currently. Maybe if... Okay, I'll try to open every door so I'll know I've been to at least that door. 
sign that probably means something that's not currently operating right now. I mean, this is kind of the toy factory area. Or clock tower area for... I thought it was a toy factory. At least I think I remember it being a toy factory. But that might just be how I remember it. There's the bowl I threw away. Okay, this is definitely going to be one of those days. Because I know I had to hop across a lot of rooftops back then. It was one of those things. Action Game 101, you have to jump across rooftops like you're a Ninja Turtle. Uh, I was interfered with by an enemy. I was trying to ponder my way out of here. Remember, I can't break blocks, so in unless I use... And even then, I'm not entirely sure that would work. Like, will my explosive powers work here? That is a very good question. Like, is it, like, super block protected? Or just sort of block protected? Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna try to do something. What? And it could be a little odd or weird how it works. If it even works at all. So let's let's see if I can Okay. I am going to attempt to blow something up. I mean, it's a good thing that I have a mount with an explosive shot, or this wouldn't even be a possible experiment. Okay. Try to stare. We're having some interesting issues here. I'm curious if your ability can theoretically bypass it. Especially when there's some things that seem a little more suspicious than others. So let's see, what do I want to explode to test? Should I hit the wall itself? Should I go by this building? No, maybe not. Was there something over here? Oh, Spectre. Nailed it. That one took some serious damage. Whoop. I almost hit it. Where are you? Oh, no, I'm, 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 I'm going the wrong way. I think the Spectre kind of got a good grip on me there for a little while. Okay, buddy, hold on for a little while while I try to f recover a bit. Could it be that I have to go down here in that way? Because that kind of looks like it would work. I was going to blow something up and then the specter happened. <laughs> I want him to recover a bit so I can... Okay, this is there. So it doesn't really connect behind. This is just the, like, the secret path. So th that's what this is. It's not really meant to connect outside. That's what I saw before, in terms of what I thought was a passage out. I could still try it, though. Hmm. Here or there. Well, there was a big area that I thought looked suspicious. So I'm going to try that as my next run. Okay, buddy. I'm, I'm hoping you've, you've recovered enough because we're going to try blowing our way out of here. So, as they used to say, 
Let's blow this popsicle stand. Okay, see that looks suspicious and very gold, so I'm going to blow it up. Okay, why is it hurting? Maybe it has something to do with uh, what I just did? Maybe just flying over areas can cause you kind of a little bit of damage? Right down. I've got to try. Maybe it's his own attack. Is he? But usually he's immune, so that could be a bug. See if I can line up for an explosive attack. Turret time. Okay, uh, I'd like to repeat something from Tony Stark. Allow me to present the Jericho. I might not remember that line, but uh, hey, whatever. Sorry, gold. I whiffed the gold anyhow. Fair enough. Uh... Okay. This could be absurdly risky. Like, I know it's absurdly risky. But I gotta see if I can fly out. I can! I broke the block. Uh, I broke the box. About to say I broke the blocks, but that's pretty much the same thing. Because <laughs> uh, I officially blew it up. So I can use this place pretty much however I'd like if I bypass the rules. Uh, that, that's kind of fair. But, at the same time, I'm wondering, how do I exit Traverse Town? Because it's it's not letting me find a normal way out. I just arrived due to the end, not the normal way. Like, that goes into the Merlin's area, that's uh, that interconnected spot over there. It doesn't connect on a way that would normally be considered going out. Well, that could be. Maybe I do get there. Okay, let me try to settle down. Okay, buddy, you need to rest. Because you have been hit hard with something. I'm still not entirely sure if that's some, like, property of this dimension or what, but... My beholder is beholding a problem. Okay, I have been... well, I've been in this whole area. That's pretty much the thing, is I'm trying to figure out where I could have missed any way to get... Um, out. But it's not uh, working out that way. Do I have to go down? I This seems vaguely familiar. But was this the way out?
Mm, I think this was mostly the secret stuff. I'm getting wolves and slime balls. But exits? No. It's like, would you like to exit? Uh, no, we're not letting you exit. We're giving you everything in the world but an exit. Well, this world, anyhow. Yeah, that, that's a that's a big nope right there. Um, so, I tried. I, I really did try. I even did the little secret little passage thing, and... Wait. No, that's just a door that didn't make it. Uh, okay. So what could possibly be a way out? Because I'm 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 really having issues here. I mean, I've only got so much of my own food before I have to start nibbling from this place, and I don't think the supply is indefinite. But I will be able to eat. Uh, creatures around, at least. But how long will I really be able to rely on that? I don't know. Okay, that goes that way, that goes that way, that was there. Did I miss something going this way? So I think that's the big building. Do I... Wait, do I go over there somehow? Wow. I almost made it. Behold my jumping powers did not really get beheld. Um, I kind of went that way, but I didn't go fully this way. Could this be the answer I'm looking for? Please, let me out of Traverse Town back to the overworld. That's all I'm asking. Gold is a nice bonus, I'm not even worried about taking that with me. But if it's there, it's there. And I did get it by figuring out a solution that was a little outside the box. Uh, more wolves. That's an interesting way of doing a, a light. This is so obviously work in progress. Like, there, there's, there's no way I can really fully get up there right now. Unless I need to... maybe I missed something on a certain floor of it? But I don't think so. Because I think I've been everywhere in town. Although I suppose I can go back to the, uh, to the top of the tower again. Okay, buddy, one more ride. One more ride. Let's, let's go to the top of this blatantly mysterious tower that's kind of calling out to me saying, Hey, over here, silly. Let's see if it actually goes. No, that's just the chest. There's no route out that I can find. Uh, I, I I might have to do desperate action. I'm not I'm not sure exactly what I need to do, but it's it's not letting me figure it out so easily. Does anybody know a way out of Traverse Town? Because I'm very curious. If I'm the reason why you're uh, finding the Kingdom Keys mod that goes so, uh, so much into Kingdom Hearts. Uh, thank you. But I'm gonna have to see if, if maybe the wiki knows, or if it's still, the whole thing is work in progress. Because that's the impression that I've been getting. If, if, if uh, there's any impression that I have been, is just work in progress. I, I don't know if there's an interdimensional teleporter I can use to get back to the overworld. Although, there is a mod I know of that has something like that. And at least I know this means that there's no way that this overwrote my house. 
the weirdest thing is I'm going to have to do it. Uh, I, I know I pretty much don't have certain things in here. Wait. Uh, overworld portal. XP utilities, too. I can't actually use it, though. Ugh. And I can't really place blocks, so whatever I did, I'd have to use out, out of my hand, and I can't use the Enderwing Prime because it's uh, keyed to dimension as well, so... Wrong dimension. Can I use this to get to the strong... See, it says only dimension zero. Uh, so I can't get to any way out of here that I can think of without adding another mod. And even then, I might have to do something else, because I, I just can't think of a way to route out. Well, maybe I can use the creatures for some magic practice or something while I'm along the way, but th this is just... Uh, one of those one of those times where I'm wondering what am I going to do. Well, until then, I think I'm just going to log off because maybe I'll have to do desperate measures, maybe not. I don't know. But until then, I'll be logging off. So hope to hear from you all later. So bye for now, everybody.